A 26-year-old Beatrice man has pleaded no contest to lesser charges in the December 2020 gunshot death of Alex Rader of Beatrice. Under beefed-up security in Gage County District Court, Brandon Long entered the pleas to charges of making a terroristic threat and possession of a deadly weapon in the commission of a felony. Charges of second-degree murder and use of a firearm to commit a felony were dismissed. The hearing produced a short outburst from a family member of the victim who quickly left the courtroom. District Judge Rick Schreiner issuing a warning. I have yet to decide whether or not I will drag that individual back in or take him into custody. I will not take any time to make that decision later. So if anybody else acts the way she just acted, I will not be taken into custody until I can decide what to do with you later. Several family members of the victim were in the courtroom Monday morning as County Attorney Roger Harris gave the basis for the arrest and charges. Police were sent to a Beatrice home of Brandon Long and his fiancée December 30th, just prior to midnight, finding a man outside critically wounded. Police provided aid before rescue personnel arrived on the scene. Harris said after the hearing that the case was complex and that his office wanted to make sure of a conviction in the matter. The convictions against DeLong, a former state corrections employee, carry a potential prison term of up to seven years and more than three years of post-release supervision. By law, because of the gun conviction, the sentences must run consecutively. Judge Schreiner ordered a pre-sentence investigation, setting sentencing for February 3rd. The amended charges were filed just prior to Monday morning's plea hearing, which replaced a trial that was scheduled to begin on Monday. From Beatrice, Doug Kennedy, News Channel, Nebraska.